Hi everyone, I'm Chanel from Stamping Stilettos and I'm here today with a super fast card. It is a Daisy Delight tag card and of course you could make the matching tag to go with the present as well. Um, but I'm not going to show you that because you just have to repeat this step here very, very fast. Let me tell you what you're going to need to make this. I'm trying to be fast because my craft room in the mornings when it's super sunny um, I only have a limited amount of time before it gets too bright in here so I'm going to try and get this done fast so no chit chat for me today right okay so what you're going to need is the Daisy Delight Daisy Delight stamp set that's it today and um, the tag topper punch and then I'm also using the triple banner punch as well but that is it really not much to it um, cardstock is Calypso Coral, eight and a half by five and a half, scored at four and a quarter. I'm going to do that now. And then we are also using the Delightful Daisy Designer Series Paper. Loving this particular pattern, it's just gorgeous. So what I'm going to do, as I'm telling you, I'm going to glue them down and try and get it done super fast absolutely love this designer series paper so many gorgeous designs in fact i've used up one of the designs and um with the card i wanted to make this one and i was like oh my gosh i've used it all up right and um, so that's your front piece and that was sorry if i hadn't told you it was five and three eighths by four and one eighths then some whisper white which is four and one eighths by five and three eighths and that's for the inside. And then you will need a piece of Whisper White, which is two inches by four inches. And then a small piece of Calypso Coral, which is three quarters of an inch by three inches. So let's go ahead and do our stamping. Using basic black for the sentiment. Go ahead and ink that up. And this is your thoughtfulness. Brighten my day now. Put it in the middle, and then we're going to use the tag topper punch. And I smudged that, so oh dear, it's a tiny little bit. It will be okay. I've just I've got a tear on the back of that. That will be okay, we'll, we'll just banner that. Right, okay, so that's that, and then we're just gonna take the banner punch and turn that into a banner, so that's all there is to that. And then what we'll do, just bring in the um, tag topper punch in, let's go ahead and do that and then we're using always artichoke and the long stem and we want to do <coughs> three of these so making sure that you leave room to put the flower heads we're just going to do three of these different lengths and then, still using always artichoke, we're using the other stems. And I'm going to do stamp on and stamp off with this one. I don't want it exactly the same colour, so stamp off, stamp on. And then we're using like the little, they look like lavender buds, but we're just doing them in green. Gonna pop them down. Now you might do a better job of lining them up, but I don't think it really matters. And then I'm using, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> Calypso Coral. I'm gonna go here ahead and bring in the outline flower head. I'm just gonna do the three like that. 
and then with the stamp off, I should have left my paper, shouldn't I? The stamp off, stamp on technique. We're just going to fill those in. Just hope you can see what I'm doing. It's getting sunnier in here. And that's what that looks like. How beautiful is that and how super fast. You know, you could make lots of these, especially with the tags. Then I have some ruched ribbon that I had left over. And, oops, I'm just going to cut. I just did the length of that. And I've cut that the wrong way, but never mind. I'm just going to thread that through and bring that round like that. And then I'm just going to... Might be a bit long, I think. Cut that down. We can always trim it if we need to. And we have our card already. We're going to use some stamping dimensionals to put on the back. I told you I'd get this done fast. She says, get the sticky things off. And look, the sun's about here now. <laughs> so, um, and then put your, and that is a bit long, I think. Let's just trim these a little bit, I think. That's better. And we're just going to stick that down like that. And then I'm just going to put some glue on the banner. Like that. and pop that across there and there you have it oh no we haven't yet I have some pearls I always forget my pearls why do I do that right taking some pearls I'm just going to pop one down in the center of these gorgeous flowers just to give it a little bit of a pop and there you have it. I mean, it is super fast. I mean, I think I've done that in less than five minutes, I think. But how gorgeous and how pretty are those cards? Oh, look. This, oh, there you go. I don't know if you can see. It's very sunny here. You can see, probably. Hopefully. <clears throat> um, but I think I've timed that about right. I don't like shadows on my videos. But there you have it. A very, very quick um, card today and very pretty like I said you can use the tags and have them on the presents as well matching ones but I hope you've enjoyed today's um, tutorial and I hopefully will come back later with another one um, but if not I will see you tomorrow so take care my lovelies and see you soon bye bye